You try to plan a jail for about 20 years. 18 years in, the Pottawatomie County Jail is nearly full. Inmates being housed in temporary beds. Sheriff Jeff Danker says the facility is bursting at the seams. Uh, it's a 288-bed facility. Our, we've had a high now of about 312. That's why Danker asked the Pottawatomie County Board to fund a $136,000 project to add 53 more beds to the jail. And that'll be... Some cells that were single bunk will be double bunked. It's a temporary fix, he says. The real solution, new construction. We're looking at probably putting another housing tower behind uh, this to the north and then connecting connecting the, the two buildings together. Pottawatomie County Supervisor Justin Schultz says the board is working with Danker one step at a time. There's an obvious space issue that we have there. Um, and, you know, we have to try to be creative at how we increase the capacity as well as you know trying to keep in mind that there's taxpayer money that's involved. Schultz says the board will also consider funding programs to keep people out of the jail like mental health services. But Schultz says he knows they'll need more space sooner rather than later. I think it's a definite need. Um, I'm thinking probably anywhere from three to five years that we need to really start getting serious about how we're going to handle this. In Council Bluff, Sarah Feely, KETV News, Watch 7.